Welcome back to the vlog. Today's video starts out with a story about my beloved Jeep Wrangler, and the story actually goes back to the weekend. It was a lovely Sunday afternoon, perfectly sunny out, and we as a family decide that we're gonna go for a walk on the rail trail. And as we're coming down here to leave, I'm getting Clark's bike and we're loading it up into the truck. I'm like, you know what? Why don't we take the Jeep? It's a beautiful day outside, and reluctantly, Cody agreed. She doesn't like riding in the Jeep because it messes up her hair. What can you do though? I mean, it's a Jeep. So we all load into it. I get Clark's bike in the back, get him strapped in. I go to turn the key. There was nothing, no lights, no nothing. So luckily my father-in-law, being the hero that he is, he gave this to me a while back. This is a battery charger. And I hooked this up last night. I charged it for like maybe three hours. And as you can see, the light is on here. I haven't tried starting it yet, but I'm gonna do that right now because what I would like to do in an ideal world, if this works, is start the Jeep up drive to Clark's school, pick him up from preschool, and then drive this over to get a new battery put into it. Let's give it a shot here and see what happens. Noise! Look, it's 424. Here is the battery in question. It's from 2016, which really isn't that long ago. I think a big problem that I have is that the battery is a little bit older, plus I don't run this nearly enough. It was like two weeks since the last time I started it up. So I don't want to run into this again. I don't want to have a moment where I want to go out and enjoy this and I can't because of a battery. You got to go inside, little bear. It's running. In fact, I didn't turn it off because I don't know if it's going to start back up. Nice. You see that? <laughs> My favorite picture I made with Clark and a watermelon. You ready to go get a new battery for the Jeep? Yeah. Bye, school. Where's the battery shot? It's down the road a little bit. <laughs> this isn't the battery shop. There's Kmart and there's the battery place. Pretty close. This is where we need to go. Let's turn it off. And out of curiosity, let's see if it turns on. Yeah, it turned on. We would have been okay. You know how expensive batteries are? Huh. They're pretty expensive. After you, sir. I was wondering if I could get a battery installed for my Jeep. Okay. Here. It's a 2005 Jeep Wrangler. The one in there, it says, uh, I think November 2016. Okay. But it's like, if I don't drive that Jeep in a couple weeks, like it, it doesn't start, so. Well, that's because no matter what, there's a parasitic draw on the system. Mm -hmm. uh, typically batteries last three to, s between three and six years. Okay. Um, if it sits for several weeks, the best thing to have is a battery tender. Oh. Because then it'll keep the battery, you know, fully charged. I see. And then once it's fully charged, it shuts off. I can test it just to make sure. Let's see. A little bit low on charge as for, you know, the cranking amps, but other than that, it's, it's good to go. Okay. So probably just get a tender for it. Mm -hmm. Thank you so All much right. for saving me 130 some dollars. <laughs> That's, that, I really appreciate it. How about that. the new Because some places you go to, they would just be like, oh yeah, we'll get you a new battery and not do the right thing. Well, that was easy, Clark, man. We don't need a new battery, apparently. Basically, the guy said that if you don't run your vehicle often, which this Jeep doesn't get run that often, you should get a battery tender, which are about $30, and that'll keep your battery charged. But my battery's good. Saved a lot of money, dude. Yeah. Juice left. Little bit, lots of juice left. Give me that five. Give me a bigger five. Ah. A bigger five. You know what we can do now? Uh -huh. go we, to Kmart. we can go on a shopping spree with all the money we saved. Let's go to Staples. We can get some office supplies. No. <laughs> go to okay. At least it was an excuse to get the Jeep out today. Look at that. Look at that. Starting right up. Huge shout out to Advanced Auto Parts. Great people there. I've had nothing but good experiences. And they saved me from buying a battery today when they could have told me. That I needed one and made some money off me. We're here already. That was a quick drive. Yeah. And it's getting a lot warmer out here today too, which is good. It was a little chilly driving in to pick Clark Man up. 
Kmart is about as busy as it always is these days. Oh, I got you. I don't got you. Oof. Oof. All right, let's go. Okay. This kid's excited about Kmart. Don't cross without me. This is how we cross roads. Into the Kmart. Oh, that's a train. Fail. <laughs> Section. No. Please on the plane. I wouldn't have never guessed. <laughs> I like that right there. That's really cool. Yeah, people on a pumpkin. Hey, there's two sacks of pumpkins. Just a of pumpkins. Pretty neat. Alright, I'm gonna go to March and check out. Dead end. Skeleton. <gasps> oh, it's right down there. What do we got over here, Clark? Um, I don't see. Where are those monster trucks at? What? <laughs> no monster trucks? What's the world coming to? Oh, there they are. There they are up there. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. They got higher education over here in Bounty Hunter. They got, what is that? Son of a digger? Really? And behind that, Megalodon and something's curse. That's it? What? What? Is that Grave Digger? It's called Son of a Digger. Why is he called Son of a Digger? Son of a Digger. I don't know. That's his name. I see a lot of There's empty space. There's Son of a Digger up there. What? What are these things? I don't know what that is. Uh, oh. Crazy crashing action. Push down and swipe. Uh, what the heck is that thing? Um, so the gear goes inside and the car race past and the gear pops out. His working garage. Take this. Okay. And the car goes zoom in and goes. Oh, it tried, chomps him. Yeah, it tries to eat the car. Hmm. My kid's a little crazy about Hot Wheels. <laughs> what you blind bag? You want to do blind bags? Yeah, I got pretty. You got a lot of blind bags there, boss. Yeah, I really, really want to see what's inside. They're definitely easier to store than these big play sets. So, pick out what you want out of there. Feel, feel them up and see. Oh, yeah. That's a good one in there. I can tell. What's that? Real Tonka Tough. Is that another mystery thing? Got two things. Okay. You can ride that bike right there, that motorcycle. Dude, that looks awesome. Yeah. Does it have training wheels? Um, no. Ooh. I think we'll stick with your quad for now. Here's all the action figure things. I'm Clark Man. I'm Clark Man. They got the Raccoon Mario. Yeah. Why they call him Raccoon Mario? Isn't he Tanuki Mario? What's going on here? These are actually pretty cool. I like that. How much are they? We'll never know. Ooh, that is awesome. A Paw Patrol bike. That's pretty neat. Paw Patrol. Uh oh. Zzzz. No! Zzzz. Happens every time. Oh no. Oh <laughs> great. Does this one light up? How'd you turn yours on? When I press this button. Oh. Mine doesn't have a button. Yours is way cooler. Okay. No! Is that our bear? Yeah. Mine doesn't make any noise, so I have to use your noise. Yeah, I can use this as my pointer. Over here, you'll see some Overwatch toys and Jurassic World. Yeah, here, here's this up here. Okay, copycat. Spider-Man, 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 Spider-Man. Ow. Is it wet? It's, it's not wet. You can't fit your little melon through there? Yeah. Oh, man. They make it so you can't wear it. How do you know if you want to be Spider-Man? I found my Halloween costume. Ah! I'm Iron Man. My chin's sticking out a little bit. Even better, I'm now a war machine. <laughs> Who was poking me in the eye with a lightsaber? <laughs> Look at this amazing Thomas collection. They've got Theo, they've got Percy, they've got Thomas and Gordon and Hurricane, which we don't have yet. Percy! And they got Percy. Yeah, it was kind of lackluster, to be honest. I think we're pretty much done here, Clark, man. Do you want to go out for lunch with me? What? Where are we going to go for lunch at? Come here, it's a secret. McDonald's. <gasps> yes, yes, yes! Of course, of course, of course. Uh, but, uh, 
We're just now on open these. Okay, we gotta pay for them. Okay. No luck in the Lego scene. Yeah, I'm gonna stay ever, Dad. I, 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 I want to have some nuggets. This Sounds good. I found that oh, thing. This is 50% off. Oh, look at this. It's, it's a car wash. It's a car wash. 50% off? This is called Balance Breakout. Balance Breakout? Tip the scale and win. Huh? Let's look at the back. Oh, geez. So you launch them. And they fly up to, to that thing. And, they're, and oh, then you try to save those cars. This is like a really cool game. Yeah, you're trying to save the cars from there. I think the goal is to get as many in there and you win. And, uh, Race to tip the scale and free the trapped cars. Trap door releases cars. Dude, we gotta get this. Yeah. You think? Yeah. You think so? Yeah. And it's 50% off. That's so cool. We can do this against each other, Clark. Yeah. And I can win and beat your booty. I, I can win and beat your booty. I don't think so. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Not, uh -uh. Not happening. We'll just keep this back here and hopefully nobody messes with it. What talk is in here? I don't, I don't know what it is. We'll find out here in a second. Okay, I'm wrapping. It's a little telehandler thing and oh boy, this is cheap. I hate to say that in front of Clark, man, but this thing was $3 and... I don't know, dude. I think we might have got hosed on this one, Clark, man. There you go. Open oh, Clark, he's my filmer, and we're opening up to reveal. That's cool. As Ramon, I want to be like a queen. Well, you, it's a mystery. You never know what you're going to get out of here. But that's definitely a better buy than the Tonka one, in my opinion. I think that's I'll nice. Take the little Tonka out, put it in there. Hello, garage. We haven't been here in a while. Yeah. It's, it's, it's oh, look, Dad. Hot Wheels Happy Meal. Looks like you're getting Happy Meal. What number are we? Four, eight. No, try again. Four, what uh, number is that? Three. What number is that? Four. Three, four. 34. 34. That's right. I got one Happy Meal, one yogurt, and... Chocolate milk. And chocolate milk. Sweet and sour sauce. Sweet and sour sauce and nuggets. Yummy. This? Yes. Uh-oh. Ah, <laughs> nuggets. Go. Oh, yes, this is the one I really wanted. You got the one you wanted? Yep, this. Sweet, dude. This. All your nuggets are now in the bottom here. See, that's how it looks Look at that. Hey, there's a nugget in the middle of the pie. And you just want to leave your nuggets in there? So I can just grab okay. And they got your chocolate milk. Daddy got a quarter pounder and we got french fries and sweet and sour sauce. We are hooked up here, dude. Cool. All right. Let's chow. Hot meal, happy meal. Ooh. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Yeah, it's like a Hot Wheels bone I can't believe you got the one you wanted, dude. Yeah. That's lucky. Yeah. Now it's like lucky. I thought you wanted one of these Barbies, though. No. What? No. I... Girl stuff. I like this princess one because <laughs> I like them. It's girl stuff. Girl stuff's okay. Flying chocolate milk. Whee! Woohoo! Careful coming out here. Flying chocolate milk. Little car on top of the lid. You think anyone stole our Hot Wheels out of the Jeep? Let's see if it's still in here. Yep. Still in there. Dude. I think this is probably where this video is going to end. Do you want to tell everyone thank you for watching? Thank you for watching. Bye. And remember, it's not just Greg's world, it's. Our world! And a Hot Wheels world. <laughs> and a McDonald's world. <laughs> a McDonald's world? We are looking for sponsors, McDonald's and Hot Wheels. Give us a call.